Hi everyone, welcome back to Training Time. Today I'm going to be reading your dream updates in Star Stable. I posted a story on Instagram asking you guys to submit your dream updates. I'm gonna see what you came up with. <laughs> also, this is Jerry. I need to go pumpkin hunting today because I want the outfit. I wish these would save. I don't want area notifications at first, pumpkin hunting was very, very confusing for me and it was hard to understand how to even do it, but I have the hang of it completely. So for my dream update, oh my god, seriously? I don't know if I should train a curly or I don't know what horse I should train. Oh, I did buy an expensive witch hat just because it goes with this dress. I don't know if Star Stable watches my videos, maybe they'll see your dream update. Hopefully. Why is my head in this horse? My favorite Star Stable videos to watch are update idea videos. In my Halloween update video, the whole entire stable was going black and white. I did not realize that there was a little girl in there. That was a scary experience. For my dream update, I want to be able to change your lead when cantering and also change diagonals when posting at the trot another thing is halters and lead ropes i just feel like that's a practical thing that we really need let's just say blankets too while we're at it oh my gosh <laughs> i have a ton of dream updates a photo mode for videos weather would be really nice too i'll start reading yours now because i've said like six different things at this point Running pigs, bruh. It would be so cute if those little pigs that we have, if they could run. Be able to have an option to ignore everyone. That's amazing. I would love to have that. Oh my gosh. Or having the option to ignore everyone but your club or but the people on your friends list because lately I've been hearing at the riding hall that there's drama with clubs doing dressage. Clubs will be doing dressage in the riding hall. They don't want, you know, other people getting in the way, so they have to ignore everyone. I experience this when I'm filming too. If you had just an option to hide all players, nobody would get offended. More tech, to be honest, like blankets, halters, etc. Yes, everyone's been saying halters, 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 blankets. Just things that you think we would have because this is a horse game, you know? This is turning into pumpkin hunting time instead of training time, but I hope you guys don't mind. Okay. Oh, okay. Updated quarter horses. I complete- oh. Okay, stop attacking me. The quarter horses in the game right now, I don't feel like they represent the quarter horse breed that well. So I would love having updated quarter horses. Same with thoroughbreds. Hi, being able to ride friends horses. I got this submission a lot. I don't know if SSO would ever let you do that because they want you to buy your own horses with your star coins. And if you rode your friend's horses, you could just use them for anything and then you'd never buy the horse, you know? It's a good idea anyway. Can they please let our characters eat food at cafes? You mean have animations for eating? I guess the food just sits there and we don't even get to eat it. We just do nothing with it. Tack Lab. A shop where you can create your own tack. Choose color, stitching, decor, and buy. That sounds really cool. Star Stable adding a real life camp so that SSO players can meet up. I would just say if they had more meet and greets. Being able to change the height and overall traits of our characters is only one of my dream updates. I feel like that would be really difficult with our characters, so I was thinking about it. Our characters are so important because we see them every single time that we log on. They're updating the NPCs, but we don't see the NPCs as much, and our characters are a lot more important. But if they changed our characters, they would have to change the clothes, the animations. Our clothes wouldn't fit, you know? If they made them more detailed, it would be nice. I think it would be cool if we could have different body types and everything eventually. Apartments slash houses. 
a while ago in a quest, I think this is when we got, we unlocked Adian's Plaza. We did a quest and they gave us this furniture item and paint bucket. And we all thought that we would um, be able to have an apartment or something or decorate our home stable. None of that ever happened. I got really confused because we've had that item or those items for a long time. What are they even supposed to be used for? We don't even know yet. They gave them to us for nothing practically. <laughs> character remodel. A lot of people are saying new characters. I'll just say character remodel times a thousand because I feel like I got new characters so many times. And it's true. Our characters are such an important part of the game because when we log on, that's what we see. Did I get a bridle or something? Oh yeah, I got a bridle. Being able to create your dream coat on any horse model you want, kind of like The Sims 3. That's a cool idea. McDonald's. Awesome idea. I love that idea. Being able to pay stable care for only selected horses and for stable- oh, for stable care to cost only one star coin per day per horse. Honestly, I love that idea because seven star coins, it doesn't seem like much, but it adds up. For me, I really only would want one racing horse to be cared for and then a horse I'm training. If it were only two star coins a day, like you said, one star coin per horse, that would be a game changer. I would like some new and updated hairstyles. Agreed. <laughs> also, more realistic tack and clothes. I'm always interested in more clothes, more realistic tack. Some people were saying martingales. Not everyone uses a bridle with this kind of circle bit. In real life, there are so many different kinds of tack pieces and so many different options that anything new that SSO could give us for tack, I would love it. Being able to eat food. What is it with you guys and wanting, <laughs> wanting our characters to actually eat food? There's a million butterflies. This is a little crazy. But I've never logged on and been like, oh, I wish my character could eat some food. It must be really important, guys. <laughs> Proper first person camera option. I was watching this YouTuber. She has some really good star stable feedback is what I can say and ideas. And I was watching her videos. The camera option, it's not even really first person. I mean, they say it is, but you know, it's, it's really not. Miniature ponies or a paddock near the stable where you can see the horses. It would make sense like if you would be able to lead your miniature pony around and leave your home stable while leading. I don't know, how would that even work? I would still love that either way though. Shift click to move things in and out of your, our inventories instead of dragging them. Oh, it would be so much faster. I have never ever thought of that before. But that is honestly a genius idea. I don't even know why we- Why don't we have that? More clubs slash friend spots would be nice. Imagine how big of clubs that we could have on this game. That would be crazy. There could be a club called the Nightstar Club. And everyone on Nightstar just- We could make an army. And also friend spots. You guys, I just don't like to be asked to delete- anyone off my friends list. It's not really fair. How would you feel if you were deleted off of someone's friends list? Like, nobody wants to get deleted off of a friends list. I mean, actually, I'm sure there are people who want to get deleted off, but, <laughs> you know. Correct posting diagonals and canner leads would be beautiful. That would be so amazing. It would, it would just make this game so much better and more realistic, too. A home stable in Dino Valley. If there was- oh my gosh, I'm failing. If there was a home stable in Dino Valley, I feel like more people would flock to Dino Valley. It would still probably be deserted, I'm gonna be honest. But if there was a nice, you know, city or just, you know, little tiny town area, which there kind of is, there's just no stable, so it's useless, you know? Other than- <laughs> What the heck is wrong with me? <laughs> Other than shopping, it's, you know, kind of useless. And if we had a stable, oh my goodness. <laughs> Someone said, way too much to think of one. I want everything. I want this game to have everything. Speaking of Star, let's see if she wants to call. <laughs> 
to be able to ride the horses and see their gates before we buy them. Hello? What the heck? Oh my god, I think there's a ghost in the Discord call. Hello? Hello? Oh my god, I can finally <laughs> hear you. My horse is so talented, I keep crashing on top of this pumpkin. Oh yeah, but I was reading yours. In real life, you wouldn't just pick out a horse and buy the horse. You'd test drive exactly, the horse yeah. first. There's this girl hiding in the bushes. <laughs> oh, Eve said to die. Oh, Jesus. That's really dark. Oh, and she also said to have a pasture. Oh, yeah. I think that would be good. Kicking out the butter goods from their mansion and living in it. <laughs> You know, I wouldn't mind that because the butter goods are so useless at this point. They're just there to sit and look pretty. But where would they go? Nowhere. <laughs> they can live in the hayloft of our home stable. Like, I'll give that up. What, would they just live on the streets? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Bovista? What is Bovista? What does Bovista mean? Am I an uncultured swine? I guess we both are. Oh, it's oh. a beautiful village in Jorvik. The few houses of the village all have a view of the ocean, and Bovista stables lie just east of the village. I didn't even know that existed. Me either, what the heck? Breeding, for sure. I think that would be interesting. I feel like it wouldn't work out, though. It would be really hard. Yeah. I think people are just saying, like, free horses <laughs> pretty much yeah you can't just mix breeds that are completely different like then sso would have to make com like new horses a million yeah. mixed breeds unless you bred two different horses together you would get one of the breeds but that doesn't make sense someone was saying trading Jorvik shillings for star coins i feel like you would have to give a lot of shillings yeah for that it would be work. a frustrating exchange rate it would probably be a thousand Jorvik shillings for one star coin yeah it would be something crazy if that ever existed have star stable do a giveaway where one person wins unlimited star coins that would never happen <laughs> you know i don't think that would work i don't think they would do that oh i want her leg wraps her mustard colored leg wraps a peppa pig pet Technically, oh, no. we do have pig pets. They just, I wish they were walking pets, like someone said. That would be so funny. Imagine they, like, could roll in, like, the dirt and, like, and snort and stuff. That would be so cute. <laughs> yeah. To have, like, a competition where we can compete with everyone, like, dressage and jumping. Did I just... Oh, my God. Yeah. That would be... Or, like, jumping. That would be super cool. I missed it again. Oh my god. How, How do you, you lose, lose Steve's yeah. race? It's I don't know. I just did. <laughs> Lunging or personalities that come with the horse or a different way to train. Maddie had like a similar idea. She was saying like when we first got the horse, it would be like bucking us off. And you have to like train it out of those like certain behaviors and stuff. Yeah. Which I think would be super cool. Oh my god. Steve isn't appearing. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> That happened to I me. I just see his pitchfork and that's it. <laughs> that's terrifying. Being able to name your horse whatever you want. Yes, I agree with that because I have an Andalusian named Shark Boy and I wanted to name the my white Andalusian Lava Girl and there's no lava and I'm really salty about it. I want to be able to name our horses whatever. I mean, I, I guess... If there was a filter, it would work. But yeah. SSO has been so crazy about the filter lately. You literally, like, can't say anything. How are you supposed to say, Hey, I found six pumpkins today. You can't say that. You could say, like, one, three, nine, and zero, I think. Like, if you just type the number. Oh, really? Yeah, you can. <laughs> to change our star stable names. Um, That would only work. You could change it to something that's not taken. Because some people really regret their names. I don't. I actually like my name. Yeah, your name's fine. I think I hit the jackpot with my name. I don't know what <laughs> I was thinking when I was 12, but I did my a good job, I think. Garden. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Um, We're going... To Goldspur. Goldspur. 
Yeah, well, you need to do your reputation. Never. Because you need to get this 250 race. It's a really good race. Actually, it's really not. No, it's the horrible one. I already lost. I What? How did I not go through that? Last time I did this race, I failed five times, but I think I'm going to get it this time because I know what I'm doing. Don't jinx yourself. I almost made it. I just lost. Our characters being able to jump, and I don't know what exactly, but a big game-changing update. <laughs> <laughs> what would be good about our characters jumping? I mean, it, would it be pointless or no? Yeah, because like we're on our horses literally 90% of the time. I mean, it would be fun to get off and jump over the jumps on foot, <laughs> but that's about it. <laughs> that reminds me of you. Oh my god, no. I used to jump jumps on foot all the time. Should I put that in the video? Yeah. <laughs> do it, do it, do it. Everyone will see how much of a horse girl you were. I really hate this horse. I kind of want to sell it. Well, it's going to go to the glue factory. <laughs> Good. It deserves to go to the glue factory. Writing in my native language. This new chat filter is so bad. Yeah. There is a huge issue. If people can't speak their native language and they can only speak English, I'm sure some people can't even speak English. Yeah, so and they like can't even How play are they the game. supposed to chat? I guess they don't. Time to go find pumpkines. Someone said an awesome one. <laughs> Same. All I want is stupid story quests. That's all I want. And a lot of people complain, oh, they're making too many horses, but they do say that the team that makes the horses is separate than the team that does the story quests. So yeah. new horses, apparently, it has nothing to do with story quests, but we still want story quests. I kind of agree. Like, they've been releasing a lot of horses. Yeah, a lot of the updates recently involve you spending star coins the pumpkin hunting is good because it's something that you can do that has nothing to do with star Correct. coins and you yes yeah and you earn stuff there's still a star coin part of the update where you need star coins to experience it which is annoying but it's fine i guess that's this whole game though you could give your horses a potion and they could talk to you okay that uh... is very interesting what would they say to you this one's cool like a snap map thingy where you can see your friends, but you can turn the feature off too. Oh my god, yes. <laughs> where they allow us to twerk. Technically, we can already twerk. Have you ever been to the Fort Pinta, you know, summer beach party? You yeah. can twerk. But maybe she's thinking like an animation, like where you do slash twerk and you can just, you know, go for it. I feel like that would end very badly. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, most people's dream update is star coins every day. <laughs> Remember the old birthdays where we would, on their sixth oh birthday, I swear God. we got like 600 we star did. coins? That there are a couple global servers because it's my dream to meet you. So instead of having servers based on country, there would be a few servers where you could meet anyone in the world. That would be super cool, but super chaotic. I really want the lippy's neck to not look weird when they gallop. Agreed. They used to be my favorite horse, and then I would ride them and then realize how weird they actually are. These people are following you. The cat was running while sitting, like sliding on its butt. Why is there a random pumpkin over there? Because <laughs> they're trying to be festive, okay? The option to change Dino Valley into a place that is covered in ash because of the volcano. Or they can just, like, release ash land. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You are, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> that too. <laughs> Everyone wants star coins. Same, but... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> of course. Yeah, someone said that everyone is a star rider. <laughs> you know... <laughs> Hi, Lydia. Oh my god, <laughs> There's a pile right here. Club update. Updated clubhouse being able to give leaders more power. For example, edit calendar and add remove members. And personalized club shirts. We were talking about this yesterday. We were talking about how the leaders should have more roles. Because what's the point of the club leader? What's the point of the roles, I guess? They don't really do anything. Other than yeah. being able to have a seat in the clubhouse. There were personalized shirts what if you had a personalized shirt 
when you join a club, but you don't get the shirt when you're out of the club. Ooh, it that'd makes be it super really cool. Special. It's kind of like in Alicia how you can make a you can make a badge for your guild. You customize it however you want with like different scrolly thingies. Interesting. I don't even know how to make it really because I I never owned a guild on there. <laughs> but I mean, it seemed to work pretty well. Yeah, it seems like a cool idea when fort maria opens it's been like, just sitting there for so long and it seems like it would be way cooler than fort pinta sorry I james know. but fort I'm maria sorry. is cooler because you can okay you can see it from here you can probably see everything from fort maria and it's above new hillcrest which is a stable on a beach that's so pretty and then the same person said the old king's road opens in golden hill <laughs> i mean when is that going to open probably never more choices for the horse's mane slash tails like if the options were separate oh it's interesting how you can't change this horse's mane this fjord oh you can't no you can't do any mane what the heck which is funny because wouldn't it be easy to just put your horse's mane as hearts or you know the fjord styles yeah like what maybe they were just too lazy to add more <laughs> styles to have toilets and better animations for our characters. <laughs> what, are we gonna, like, drop, like, a brick or something? <laughs> I don't think you need toilets in a horse game, but that's just, that's my unpopular opinion. To delete all the horses. Wait, what? Like, if you want to delete all the horses and you don't want a horse, you can do that. What? What? Why would you do that? <laughs> because what if you want to do that? <laughs> um, they will probably never add that. This is a horse game. <laughs> so, <laughs> sell all the horses, I guess. Someone said toilet paper. This is a different girl. <laughs> okay, but like, why? <laughs> it's like an ongoing thing. Like, do people actually want like our characters to go to the bathroom? I don't think so. I don't think so. Maybe they're thinking of like something like The Sims, but what's the point? Like, oh my gosh, I can't. Our characters are pixels. They don't need to go to the bathroom. <laughs> why is that so funny? To be able to customize your horses, more main styles, painting their hooves, etc. Painting their hooves. Yeah, they um, want their hooves painted. Yeah, no. I'm going to paint my horse's hooves. <laughs> I think my horse's hooves are better. No, they're not. My horse's hooves, they just look more beautiful. <laughs> you look like a creep. <laughs> yeah, I'm painting. Sorry. Let's roleplay painting hooves. <laughs> Good idea. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Bye. <laughs> the girl's back. I'm sorry, Thunderbolt. I feel so bad. Don't sell it then. I need to sell it. Didn't you hear the girl? The horse is going to go to the glue factory. Good. Do you really want that for your horse? Yeah, I do. The other day, the pumpkin... <gasps> I sold it. <laughs> Seriously? <coughs> Do we just burp at the same time? Yep. yep.